exactly. New season is what two weeks away tomorrow. If you want track, you're happy. Yeah, I mean, we've um, we've put a lot of hard work in, a lot of hard yards. I think talking with the staff this morning, I think that's one of the reasons why we potentially looked a bit leggy on Tuesday with the work that's done. We, you know, we've, we've, we've been putting a lot of work into the players. They're not like normal match prep days, you know, we've been having them in the morning of the game and and doing work, you know, fitness work the morning of matches and stuff like that, which is not normal procedure. But from now, you know, I, met, I spoke with the players today and the staff and said from today, it's we're in season mode now, we're in the zone. So we'll start prepping properly now for games in terms of how we do it in the season. It's not it's not about the fitness, we've got that into the legs now and into the body and the lads have have done that great. But now we've got to have a freshness about winning the games. We've got to have performance levels high, we've got to get into that winning mode. And that's what we'll be looking to do um, in the next three games. Certainly tomorrow v Crew in Friday v Tramia. Yeah. I'll be looking at Solfad on Tuesday with, you know, what sort of team do I select there in terms of um, do I get the good work in terms of preparation for for Walsall and on the training pitch and play play the, the more senior lads on the Saturday and the Friday? That's my mindset at the moment. But there is one or two players who are a little bit short on numbers, so for the Tuesday that that can be the, the game for them. So um, it's all balancing. But as I said, now uh, the real was was zooming in as it is on um, all the little bits and pieces and tightening things up certainly on the tactical side of the game, ready for, for Walsall on the 5th. Have you got a start in the 11th of Walsall in your mind, and are the lads changing your mind? I've, I've got an idea, I've, of course I've got an idea, I certainly know the, the formation and the system we'll be going with, but as I've said to the lads all along, it's up to them to, mm. to put them in the, themselves in the picture. What I have to have leading up to Walsall is, I have to have as many problems as possible. I, I need to have as many players put themselves forward to be in the star on 11. So when I do select the team Thursday... They make it hard for you. Absolutely. And it, it's difficult for me to give them an explanation why they're left out. Though it needs to be a conversation where, I'm sorry you're not in the team. It's only because I can pick 11 players. It's not, you know, we felt you haven't done this or you haven't done that. So that's what I'm looking for now. I've spoken to them and they're well aware of the lads of what's required in these these coming weeks, these last couple of weeks where we really intensify now. It's about performances and it's about results because uh, we do want to get that winning habit. It doesn't matter what, what you're playing in friendlies, league games, cup games. I've never focused in on that in the previous games because it was all about f fitness and, and no injuries as such. So we, 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 can, we can really focus in on those aspects now.